The Food and Agriculture Organization, FOA, of the United Nations has reported that 1.39 million hectares of cropland have been submerged by flooding in the northeastern part of the country, worsening an already severe food insecurity crisis. This announcement was made during the 2024 food or World Food Day event, which held in collaboration with the Adamawa State Government in Yola. Speaking at the event, Dauda Dumbia, FAO Head of Office for the Northeast, represented by Dr. Abdullahi Usman, FAO Field Office Coordinator for Adamawa, highlighted the significant impact of flooding between September 16 and 30. The FAO officially expressed concern over the region's worsening food insecurity due to climate change, emphasizing the rain-fed and irrigated crops land in Bonu, Adamoa and Yobe, the Bay State, have been severely affected. Over 104,000 hectares of rain-fed cropland and 6,570 hectares of irrigated cropland were submerged, leading to estimated food losses of 166,731 metric tons. Represented by Halima Mohammed, Program Manager, Adamawa Agricultural Development Agency, Jatau acknowledged progress uh, toward achieving zero hunger by 2030. However, he stressed that hunger and malnutrition still affect millions worldwide. Yeah, particularly in the Northeast, we are confronted with profound issues of food insecurity. Recent data revealed that from 16 to 30 September, approximately 3.82 million hectares of land experienced flooding, affecting 1.39 million hectares of crop land. Among the hard hit states are Bonu, where 143,395 hectares of crop land were flooded, and Adamawa, where 58,588 58, hectares of land were also affected. The flooding has severely impacted farmers during what was expected to be a bumper of this season. The aim to contribute to a world where everyone has access to nutritious food. We are here today. We acknowledge the progress made towards achieving zero hunger by 2030. Yet, we also recognize that hunger and malnutrition persist, affecting millions worldwide. Agriculture generally managed by smallholder and lack of access to mechanization. Their production is always slow, which results into about 2.8 billion people that cannot afford healthy diet. State, aside from all those mentioned areas, which have Direct effects on in Nigeria, in Adamawa State, we have flooding, which affects over 50,000 people, just 2024 20, alone, with significant damage to agricultural lands, infrastructure. This requires for urgent, fast, quick, and effective action in order to solve this problem. Otherwise, in the next two, three months, these price we are expecting Harvest, I will not call it bumper harvest, we will still have lots of issues to face. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.